Jones Bones, it is your girl Unitedly Random, and today we will be choosing my tarot deck. This is day two of the intuitive tarot challenge that I'm doing for myself, and there's not really a lot to say on day two. You know, maybe some days will be a little bit shorter than the others considering the challenge. I'm just following the um, chapter or the days inside of this book, okay? Intuitive challenge intuitive intuitive tarot by bridget elsomont okay you guys should go ahead and check that out and join me on this challenge every day i will be posting a video in which i follow the days of this book to strengthen my intuition and my abilities with the reading tarot yesterday was day one if you guys want to go ahead and check that out i will pop it somewhere on this screen right here go ahead and check out day one if you haven't already but yes today is talking about choosing your tarot deck okay so i have a couple already i think i have beautiful creatures actually do i have a couple tarot decks right now i have more oracle cards now i love oracles i love 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 oracle cards i feel like there's not necessarily rules with oral card or oral give me a moment english is hard i feel like there's not as many rules with oracle cards so when i'm doing a reading i love to pull out those cards i'll flip them out and i can really speak from intuition rather than the symbolism on the cards but i also want to be able to read from the symbolism on each of these cards that is why i went ahead and i have the rider weight tarot deck okay now everyone and their mama has this card deck okay so the problems with that is um there's a little bit of the time where you want to read from intuition and there's times when you want to read from the card now i feel like if a lot of people know the symbolism and they have the idea of what the card is you can read it a certain way and someone else will be like no 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 that's not how you read it you don't know what you're doing so I want to be able to grow my knowledge of the cards and I also want to be able to grow my intuition. So that's a problem with doing the Rider Waite cards. It's kind of harder for me to grow my intuition if there's a guidebook, but I do want that information. I think my intuition is already, you know, slamming, you know, <laughs> not, not that it can't grow, but I already pick up on a lot of things intuitively, but I want to have the whole picture. I want the, the meat and the salad and I want the French fries on the side with the milkshake. Okay. If you guys, you know, feel the same way go ahead and leave a like down below but um the book asked me to go ahead and buy a tarot deck i'm not gonna buy a new deck i'm going to work off the rider weight tarot that i have okay now it also says something about quality over quantity and like let me tell you i got this deck even though it is based off of the rider weight deck it is the cheapest possible one i got on amazon okay let me know if you want that link because at the end of the day it's not just the cards that you're reading from you're reading from the symbol okay so yeah it was cheap it came with um my um everyday oracle cards that i use and a lot of these readings if you've ever been in one of my readings the ones that have like the motivational quotes on them with the nice pictures that one it came with that and that and it was like i want to say like 14 dollars, 15 dollars. but uh let me know if you want me to link that i'll give you the link and everything girl you know we're we're going for a steal we're trying to learn but you know whoo you know they, they can add up they can get a little bit expensive and i am broke as a joke that is not funny so if I were, if I were to personally today buy a deck, a deck that I love, it has a lot of, um, a lot of sisters in it. it, has a lot of, you know, it breaks the gender norms. It would be the modern witch tarot, I think. You, I don't know if you guys have seen it. If you guys watch other tarot people on youtube you've had to have seen this deck it has the girls with the puff puffs it has the fabulous guys in it it's just beautiful it's gorgeous and i love that deck now am i going to buy that deck just to follow this channel challenge no but you know what if i do all 31 days 
of this challenge that I have done to myself. I'm like, hey, Leah, you're going to do this. If I do all 31 days, I will gift myself. Ooh. I will gift myself that. I will gift myself the Modern Witch Tarot deck. I will, ooh, you know, this is motivation. You know, it was one thing, you know, Leah, the motivation to get something done. But it's another thing when you're going to receive something if you do it. Now, I promise you guys, I'm not going to, if I don't finish this challenge, I will not buy it for myself. Now, if someone else wants to buy it from me, I mean, that's a whole different thing, but I will not buy it for myself until I finish this 31 day challenge. So even if I don't complete it this time, I will start all over at day one and try to do it again until I complete it. And then I will get that debt. That is a Leah promise. Now, a Leah promises don't really mean that much, but <laughs> I'm going to try. I'm trying. Okay. So other than that, we are done with day two. You know me. You already know. Positive vibes for the weekend. Positive vibes for the rest of the... Wait, it's the middle of the week, ain't it? No, it's the weekend. Positive vibes for the rest of the weekend. And I will see you on day three. Where's the little stop it button?